Hello everyone, so my name is Louise Usher, I am a PhD student um, and I was in exactly the same position that you are now in 2015 to 2018, so it wasn't actually all that long ago and I do believe that age should never be a barrier to to go and get in your education and filling your dreams, whatever it is you want to do. Um, so when I was at school, I was interested in dietetics, um, but unfortunately there were it wasn't really encouraged then because they said there wasn't a great deal of of scope for employment at that stage, which of course is very different now. And then I took my undergraduate degree, then I went on to do an MA in creative non-fiction writing because I wanted to address people's stories to see how they'd influenced their life, what life was like for them when they were making changes in their diets. I was interested in chronic illness and chronic disease and how that can be influenced through healthy lifestyle and diet. And now it's all come together in my PhD, which is absolute dream come true. So I'm taking a little bit of people's stories and I'm taking an awful lot of inflammatory bowel disease is my area now. So I, I speak to people that have got inflammatory bowel disease and find out how life has been for them. And I capture those stories and we look at how we might be able to improve life for them going forwards. Initially, I was a bit concerned about the costs involved with becoming a, a mature student and could I still look after my family and take care of things. And very quickly, as I spoke to people and did a bit of research, I found that's a lot easier than you would think. Um, so for me personally, I found that I was entitled to some grants and things, which was really helpful and it made it very affordable to be able to come to university and focus on my studies as an undergraduate. So the employment prospects are very diverse within this course and there was a lot of my cohort, we went on to do different things. Personally for me, I'm interested in speaking to people and writing up their stories because I feel it's very linked to human interest, but there was others that went on to help train people because they were sports scientists and they wanted to help people to run marathon others went into public health so there really is a very wide range of employment opportunities within the human health and nutrition course on my graduation day it was really the day that everything came together and I thought everything that I'd written and every bit of hard work was all worth it because I felt very proud and I achieved a lot more than I expected from myself which I'll never forget